How's it going YouTube? Chug100 here. And the Dead Space remake is finally upon us. Now, if you found this video, it's because you're wondering, is it worth it to spend the extra $10 to get the digital deluxe version? Or should you just go ahead and get the standard edition? Now, it should be noted that if you have EA Play, the difference between the deluxe edition is like two dollars. I believe it was seventy-one ninety-nine to get the deluxe edition with EA Play versus the standard edition being sixty-nine ninety-nine. So, if you were thinking about getting EA Play or just trying it, uh, you could do it just for the sake of getting the free upgrade. So in the Digital Deluxe Edition, you will get five additional suits. It should be noted that you will not get the suits until after your first hour of gameplay, the first time you visit a shop, and then uh, you'll be able to change out to the suit of your picking. So let's check those out. Wow, get the bloody suit. Sanctified suit, Lone Survivor suit, Fasted suit, Venture suit, that one's badass. Once you hit the shop, select a new outfit, and Isaac will hop in here and change into it. And I will show you guys how all five outfits look on him. Got uh, some antlers made out of zombie hands. Um, there are fingers. I think that's an ear. There, yeah, there are just body parts all around him. He's got a skull. I think it says pond on it. We see that Isaac is now an undead himself, or a necromorph of some sort. Uh, I guess if gore is your thing, this is it. This is cool. Very nice. The blue and white color scheme, the um, it's almost Power Ranger like, you know. That is a cool scene. there that is yeah so we got to see this like a sneak peek of this for like two seconds there like I said when that necromorph got squished in the door um, this is just intense <laughs> I might wear this one because it's just so fitting for the game The sanctified suit. This one might be my middle of the road one here. It looks cool, but not cool enough, you know? You 
You can see uh, symbols all over the plates on his armor. There's some all over his helmet there. Uh, this is, uh, yeah, like I said, I think it's a bit vanilla, you know. So I think the suit I will stick with will definitely be between Venture and Bloody. Um, Sanctified is third place. Uh, Lone Survivor. Sanctified in the default suit may be tied for third. And then we have Lone Survivor and I, the Infested suit. I don't think I'll ever wear that. All of these suits are purely cosmetic, so if you are hoping to buy suits that have different uses, or you're fine using the default suit, the digital deluxe version may not be worth it for you. I personally love the Venture suit and the Bloody suit. Uh, that's what I'll definitely play the game in. But uh, if you don't care for that, save yourself 10 bucks. Or get EA Play and so this is meant to be sold. just spend two. But I don't think the store is anything I want.